The rover Curiosity continues to photograph weird anomalies on Mars. We're looking at a strange disc-like object embedded on the side of a small mound or hill. This photograph was taken recently on Sol 4526. Let's have a look at the photographs and then I'll show you a close-up view of this strange disc-like anomaly. We'll be looking at three photographs and as always I'll include the links to the source pages in the description. Sol 4526 Mast Camera took this photograph on the 30th of April 2025. And there's the photograph downloaded directly from the NASA site. And I've tried my best to remove the grid. The Mast Camera also photographed this on Sol 4256 on the 30th of April 2025. There's the original photograph and the grid removed. To give you a better context of where this disk is located, I combined those two photographs in a collage. You can see there's a hill there to the right, this ridge, and then this small mound or hill with the disk embedded in what looks like a possible opening. And then the final photograph, also taken by the MOST camera on the 30th of April 2025, shows that anomaly quite clearly. There's the original downloaded from the site, and now I've removed the grid and introduced a little bit of contrast. As you can see, it's very very bright and washed out. And here's a close-up at twice the original size. You can see the neat arc to that disc. It's got a strange texture to it, almost like a stone or slab type appearance. Flat and then I speculate this might be an opening on the side of this hill. You can still see some remnants of that grid visible over here. It's a pity those grids are applied to the photographs. So let me know in the comments what you guys and girls think of this disc and how large it might be. If you look at the collage, this disc seems to be quite big. And if I was to throw in my two cents worth and take a guess, I would say this is a meter or two in height, the part that's visible over there. So the radius, I would put it about one to two meters. It's difficult to tell. I don't know how far this anomaly is from the rover. I look forward to reading your comments. Thank you for following my work and research, for watching my videos, providing comments, giving a thumbs up and sharing. I do appreciate it very much. As always, thanks for watching.